Welcome back to Houston Life. Listen to this. She's a Houston native rocking the stage as part of the touring cast of Tina, the Tina Turner musical. We are so excited about this. The hit musical is making its Texas debut this week for Broadway at the Hobby Center. You just saw the show Amazing. a couple days ago. Gigi Lewis joins us now to chat about this dream gig. Gigi, you play the sister of Tina in the show. You're also Tina's understudy, Yay. which is a huge, huge <laughs> role. We want to hear all about the show, but first let's back it up a bit. Okay. Your path to the stage was not typical. It's not like a, a lot of young people who train and they do not theater and all. all of that. Yeah. You had sort of a life-changing moment on a cruise ship on years cruise ago. Ship. Yep. What happened? Um, my aunt, we did this girl trip, and um, she's one of my, well, she's the aunt that kind of helped, like, raise me and things like that. So when she said, let's go, I'm like, hey, let's go, let's do it. And in the, uh, on the cruise, there is a um, showcase or a talent show. And we walked past, and the guy was trying to set it up, and my cousin goes, you should do it. And I'm like, girl, are you crazy? I'm doing that. And she ends up signing me up, and I'm like, oh, my God. So we get there, whatever, I decide, I'm like, okay, I'll do it. And I'm sitting in the, in the waiting room, waiting, things like that, and I'm like, no, I'm not, I can't do this, I can't. And I'm trying to back out, she's not having it. And so everyone else at this time in the room is like, you know, let's try, whatever. So I get on stage for the rehearsal process of well, it. To sing what? To sing Whitney Houston, I Will Always Love. Oh, just, oh. A, just a small oh, wow. song. This, this is, is small, not hard to little, sing at all. You know, Are you kidding? This is the hardest <laughs> note in the world to hit. Literally, and one of the hardest. It's incredibly hard. <gasps> Why did I choose? It to this day, I don't know, but it works out in my favor. And we did the showcase, and the crowd went crazy, got a standing ovation. And then um, a few days later, I think maybe a week later, I was talking to Royal Caribbean, and they asked if I could make an audition. And at the time, I wasn't working, and I was in my and I and I said, you know, I'll figure it out. And um, I did a GoFundMe, and my family and friends in Houston showed up and showed out, That's got so me cool. that audition, and I did what I needed to do, and I. You nailed it. Nailed it. You nailed it. So this is, I mean, you cannot stop a candle from, <laughs> from burning bright. And you are just, it's just, it's like destiny. Yeah. I love a story like that. Thank you. And that led to a job on the cruise ship? On the cruise ship. And I was on Royal Caribbean for seven years. Seven years. Shout out to the cousin. Fantastic. Shout out yes. to the crazy cousin. Oh, yeah. I feel like that's a, you know, I don't have the talent, but I can see it. And I'm oh, like, absolutely. go, you're, you're going. Girl. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Okay, and so now you're you're on the T the Tina Turner musical. Yes. Which <laughs> is now, and I give this an A plus, five out of five stars, six out of five stars. <laughs> and as an understudy for Tina Turner, one of the most iconic voices of our generation, of our, of our lifetime, how does that feel to have to be ready to go at, at any moment? I mean, look at this action, Derek. Uh, it is an honor. To be honest, it is an honor to be able to play such a big role. And as soon as I am able to hit that stage and do that, I'm giving it my all, my everything. And then to, to feel the, in these shoes that the, uh, the uh, other Tinas are giving, it's a big shoe to feel. You know what I mean? It's something huge to step in, not only just for Tina, but for Paris and Ari and to, to those things. I, it's just exciting. Like, I, I'm speechless. I, I, I can't wait. I honestly can't wait to do it. Get on that stage and just... Take over, you know? Your energy <laughs> is infectious, and I know you are, you're so good in the show, and you're so Thank excited. You. Thank Actually, Gigi will be leaving Houston Life and going straight into rehearsals, straight into rehearsals. after this broadcast. <laughs> and can you describe to our viewers and to us just how much work this is? Because when you play not just the, the role of Tina's sister mm -hmm. and confidant, mm -hmm. you're also part of the ensemble yeah. and an understudy. Absolutely. You're essentially learning multiple roles within the same show. Absolutely. And you could go on as Tina, at any second. At any moment no. during the show. Yeah. yeah. How so, do you keep it all straight? <laughs> I Listen, I'm still learning. To be honest with you, I'm going to be really honest. I'm still pinching myself because every time something, I'm an iCat, I'm her sister, first and foremost, and I love that. I'm Eileen, her sister. And so, like, just keeping up with every character and every, um, because when I'm not um, Eileen, I'm an iCat, but I'm a different, I, you know what I mean? I have to give her a little zhush, a different little uh, whatever. And it's just, it's fun. It's acting, and it's something that I like to do. So that part comes easy. But as soon as I get on the stage, I'm like, whew, who am I right now? What's going on? You know? And um, especially like in rehearsals for learning, Tina, I, she does a lot of work with Eileen. So I have to switch mentally, which is the hardest thing to do. Because not only am I saying, my thinking about Eileen's lines, I have to know Tina's lines to be able to switch at any moment. So if I'm talking to Eileen, I have to switch from going from Eileen to Tina. That is. Oh my gosh. And wow. as, a, as a Houston native, you went to what high school now? I went to Aldine Senior High School. Woo 
Shout Government out. Thanks. Ah! And then you went to Prairie View. I went to Prairie View A&M University. Yes. Did you did you do any of the acting classes or theater classes in when you were in school? I did it in at Aldean. At Aldean, I had Mr. Lang. God bless his heart. He helped. He tried, he tried to get us together. We were all over the place. But <laughs> he introduced us to um, to theater, to acting, to drama, what is what is called in um, high school. And we had Brianna. Brianna was his assistant, and we called her Bri, and she's the one who got us together real quick and she would be screaming and hollering, Do I get another? Are you over here? Lover? But it's the it's the job. You know, you're working with high school students. We ain't worried about these shows. We ain't worried about we're just it, too busy. We're out, we're happy we're out of class. You're so, such a natural. Yeah, she opened that door up for us, her and Mr. Lang, and I never I, I never thought then that I would be here. I, I wasn't interested in that. I just wanted to be out of class. That see that <laughs> is so fascinating to me that you mm -hmm. are living Gigi a life yeah. that you never could have imagined never for yourself. Thought. Back then when you were in high school, what did you think your life would be? What did you want to do? To be honest, I was still figuring it out. I knew I wanted to sing, but I, I didn't like the the um, the um, attention. I was so scared. I was so nervous in everything that I did. I was like, I don't think I like people going, "Woo, oh my God!" Because you know, or in my face like that. And then I, I think once I got to college and did things in college, I said, I think I want to be a star. <laughs> no, I just I don't know that feeling. I don't know that pathway, but I'm gonna get there somehow. And. I just stuck with singing. That's where my heart was. That's where it was forever. And now that people are screaming and yeah. cheering for you in the crowd, oh. do you like it now? I love Is it, okay? it. Oh, I love it. I eat it up every night. Do you I'm like it? Yeah, give it to me. And the crowd, I mean, the crowds, everyone loves Tina Turner. So yeah. they're dressing up in the oh, wigs. Yeah. And how's the feedback been? Oh, the feedback is amazing. Every time we step out by the stage door, people come running. And sometimes I'm looking like, is that really Tina? Because some of them look like it's it, and I'm like, my God, they have the wigs and the and the dresses and the shoes, and I'm like, you were in those stilettos the whole show, <laughs> honey. I, my feet are aching by the end of that those numbers. So God bless you. Speaking you know? of the whole show, what's your favorite part? You you play a lot of roles, but oh, what is your favorite part of the show? I Eileen, I have to give it to the sister Eileen. That is my girl. She's she great. Me. She's she, great. She brings the, the 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 laughter. She brings you know she breaks up the seriousness in most of it, and it gives people a chance to. Uh, she's the comedic part of it. She you really know? is. And people don't know, but Eileen was really close to Tina for a long time. She was in the background, but she did everything. She managed the iCatch. She was a singer-songwriter. She was Tina's one of Tina's best friends. Like she had played a big part, and I'm I'm honored to be able to to do that in this show. I love Tina, hands down. But Eileen, I that's that's my girl. And she cuts up in church with Tina when they're little. Oh it's yeah, so funny. It's oh, so yeah. funny. I'm and sorry, so I'm giving relatable. that away. Yeah, and very, very relatable. Guess, guess who was cutting up in church? Me. Oh, same. <laughs> All of us. <laughs> Me. Yeah. Gigi Lewis, we're so proud that you have found your voice. Yes. Thank you. Literally. Thank you. And uh, and I hope you'll come back and see us. Absolutely. How Absolutely. long are you gonna be on the tour? Like, real, real uh, the tour, I believe, it's in, ends in August, if I'm not mistaken, in August. So I have a full, my contract was a year, and I started in um, October. But it's, uh, I believe, it's in August. Yeah. I'll okay. Check out. Yeah. We check out the tour dates for us. We will check out the tour dates. We can't wait to see what you do next, Thank and you. we hope you'll come back and visit us. Absolutely. Very Thanks soon. Gigi me. Lewis, once Amazing. again. Amazing. All right. So Tina, the Tina Turner musical is running right now at Hobby Center and it runs through Sunday. Yep, tickets start at $40 and uh, we'll be right back.